That has not been an issue that he has had to deal with in a long time, almost a decade, because he has had that backup that he has split 50-50 every game for the longest of time. Holmes has season. It's been scoreless at halftime. It's been a second half team when they've been able to succeed. Coming near side. Going off field is quick. Had it deflected. Her sister, Jackie, a couple of years older. More of a superstitious thing and until the team lost. That never happened until they got here to Milwaukee. In fact, there's a number of players that in the North Shore Conference have made a very clever cheers. And they come out even for soccer, volleyball, you name it, and they come. Again, this Homestead team back at State for a ninth time. The pier a second time. Things heating up here in Milwaukee as dark up. Sends one atop the box. It's just over there to Piper. Man, they're in a shootout, but I don't know if they really want to go to a shootout. Maybe they. Good point, yeah. Well, with that great goal that was scored earlier, hopefully they can uh, get another one of those. And Holmes Drelo on the restart going airborne toward Dana Vilmetti. And now trying to track it down is Bryn Darga. Darga. Back up field for Allie Miller. Bridget quick. And the Redbirds trying to take advantage. Only problem is they have a disadvantage here with a couple of defenders to one offensive weapon. Well done. And a dosi go there by Darga taking it away. Five disadvantage trying to come back near his side for Cuss, the 5 4 freshman midfielder. Even the back near his side for Stray Low. Out coming back near his side. And the ball sent across the midfield line by. Allison Ebert. Trying to keep that ball from going out of bounds and doing just that is Bryn Darga. Just pleased with the way this team has responded here under pressure. Nobody, I can expect them not only just to get here, but then to even knock off Rockishaw West. 2-2. Two -two. We're in the 63rd minute from the Eli Sacker Park. Five saves against Stevens Point Area Senior High on Thursday. Spash. Finishing time for a tenth in the final Division I. Sent off field by Wersinski. Darga. Blocked and Darga will stick with it. Coming back near his side. Somewhat eerie and, and reminiscent of what we saw a year ago. With the statistics favor Homestead yet the Pierce at times made him play. All knocked out of there by the Redford defense. Put him top by Darga. Chips it in and leaping up to knock it down. Off from behind and a restart for Homestead trying to get going. Almost desperation time you would think, but over to Eisen Brown. Back penalty is Bryn Darga. Darga knocked down by Pfeiffer. Here's spin around. Darga had it knocked down. Far sideline and the pier dumps it ahead. Trying to pay for the ball is pretty cuss. Knocked back across the midfield line. Bryn Darga. 